My name's uh, Tim Budden and I farm with my wife Jo at Higher Hacknell Farm um, and we've been here for 38 years now. Our rationale has always been that we wanted to produce good high quality food as well as abundant wildlife and uh, a, a rich e ecosystem and that is always meant that we had to be organic uh, first and foremost and I still believe that that is the only way that is actually inspected um, that will deliver the sort of uh, benefits that we were looking for. I mean it's incredible to think that when we came here um, organic farming was such a sort of uh, a rare thing. In fact I was at a at college I was prevented from doing my thesis on organic farming. I think it's, it's been a deep-seated belief of, of both of ours uh, for a very long time and I think um, possibly uh, travel uh, abroad um, made us realise what we were losing in this world and um, organic farming seemed to, to have the answers plus it was inspected it's not just a marketing exercise where you can call yourself something it, it, it is an inspected process. Well, our pledge for nature is to let our hedges, or majority of our hedges, grow uh, up and out. And uh, we, we have significant uh, mileage of, of hedges that um, I think will really benefit wildlife and to uh, fence off areas that uh, uh, aren't highly productive and encourage nature to uh, take over those areas. In these days, I think it's, 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 it's an extremely uh, easy way for farmers to help nature. The benefits are, are huge um, to nesting birds, allowing the, the blackthorn to flower and all, all the plants to uh, express themselves rather than being completely hit back um, each year. I don't think it's unreasonable that um, if a farmer has a hundred acres that they shouldn't be able to give up 10% of that land um, to nature enhancing schemes. We're being paid for doing those things now under elms and um, letting your hedges grow has got to be one of the easiest ways that farmers can really have an impact without any extra cost. In fact they're going to save money from hedge trimming. Um, and it, it's going to do so much good to the farm and the amount of biodiversity on that farm. I just think it's very, very important that um, we also have in, include food production in this and uh, that food is not just uh, 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 on the more intensive land and in chicken sheds, etc. We need to have good quality food and good quality wildlife and rich ecosystems.